Hello, you want to start off by hiding your eyebrows using two to three layers of a glue stick and then a foundation on top of that. You can do multiple layers of foundation to really hide those brows. Set that with a powder. Next, use face paints and create the ice cream drips. You can start going in with some lighter and darker tones to give it some nice shadow and depth and make it a little bit more realistic. Blend it out nicely. Next, using face paint, I just painted in the eyebrows. I wanted to go for a nice dramatic look. You can use any colour or shape you like. Now I'm going in with black face paint and I'm just going to outline the shapes. You can use eyeliner for this as well if you wish. Make sure the lines are neat. Time for the sprinkles. This step is literally so easy. You just get some coloured eyeliner or some face paints and you draw lines. Then, using white if you wish, you can also add some dots for extra sprinkles. Sprinkly! Taking some black eyeshadow, you're simply going to add some shadow using a fine brush and a blending brush and you're just going to create some nice shadow and depth. Shadow, shadow, shadow. Yeah! This step really does make the look pop. Try not to add too much and overdo this either because you can ruin it if you do. Here I'm using a makeup wipe and I'm just clearing the edges and adding some white face paint just to give a nice highlight and clean the edges up a little bit. Moving on to my eyes, I decided I wanted eyeliner, like you do normally, but a little bit more larger and more dramatic. I also went in with a pencil and lined my waterline, and then added white on top of that. I also created a cat eye look in the corners of my eyes, and added some contact lenses as well. Moving on to the lips, I'm using this glittery shimmery pink, you can use whatever colour you like and you go ahead and apply that like you normally would, yes. This section is totally optional, I am painting my neck and chest, if you'd like to do this it's exactly the same steps as your face, so start creating the drips. And because I was making this up as I was going along I decided I wanted to create a little bit of an illusion so I added some black drips as well. Here I'm just touching up my face with some foundation and setting that with a powder. And the same on your face, you're going to outline the drips, add the shadow, add the sprinkles and I also highlighted my shoulders as well. Them eyelashes make a huge difference, I highly suggest. For the final touch-ups, apply that mascara. In this video I do show the look with and without the ice cream cone but here's just me gluing the ice cream cone to my forehead using liquid latex. Here is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching my video, I hope you found it helpful and you enjoyed it. 